Hi guys, Mimi G here. Today we're gonna to be doing a slightly different video. So I don't really do beauty videos because it's honestly just not my thing, right? I'm not super into makeup um, and so it always seems a little, uh, I don't know, inauthentic for me to do videos like that. But I get asked so many questions about certain things, especially what I use on my face or what I use on my hair or how I do my hair. So I thought I would not so much delve into the whole beauty video thing, cause that would be a bit much for me, but just I maybe share some of my favorite things that I am coming across every month. And like I said, I don't do a whole lot of makeup. Usually it's like blush and mascara, sometimes a little CC cream. So I'm gonna share the ones that I love. And then um, I get a lot of questions about my skincare. So for those of you who don't know, I'm 41, I'll be 42 this year and I'm very proud of that number, but I do um, love to take care of my skin. That's one of the things that I always make sure to do. I moisturize, moisturize, moisturize. So I thought I would share some of the products that I use. I don't use a whole lot. There's just a, maybe two or three products that I am dedicated to for day and for night. So let's see how this works. So the first uh, couple of ones are gonna be about my makeup. Like I said, I don't do a whole lot of makeup and every time that I have tried, because when I see the beauty videos, when I see you guys, like these beauty gurus, I'm like, oh my God, I wanna do eyeshadow like that. But then I do it and I look a hot damn mess. So it doesn't matter how much I try to blend, how closely I follow the videos, I just suck at it. So I keep it real real basic. If I do do eyeshadow, it's like one color and then that's it. <laughs> um, I do mascara and I do blush and like I said, I do CC cream and I do love lipstick. So what I love is this CC cream by IT. So they send me, IT does send me um, new products. It looks to be like every month or so I get a gift from them. <laughs> and it usually um, has, you know, um, makeup or skincare. And so because of those gifts that I've gotten, I have found some really great products from them that I love. I haven't been crazy about everything, but the ones that I do love, I keep and I, re and I do purchase them on my own afterwards. And this CC cream is one of them. So I don't do foundation a lot, and I don't really care too much about full coverage or anything like that, and I don't like to cover my freckles. So this is really lightweight, and um, it doesn't cover my freckles, and it doesn't bother me. So sometimes when I have done foundation in the past, it irritates my skin, and I feel like I have all this shit on my face, and uh, it just doesn't feel comfortable to me. So this is lightweight, I like this, huge fan. Um, oh, and then the other thing is that it has SPF uh, 40, and you know, I am all about anything anti-aging, and they have a great anti-aging uh, line, so this is one of them. So the other thing, like I said, is mascara. So this is um, Lash Paradise. And I really love this, um, this mascara because it gives me a lot of volume and a lot of length. But I hadn't realized that the one I have been buying um, is waterproof. <laughs> and so it's really hard to get off with makeup wipes. Um, so I do love it, but I, don't, I actually don't even know if they have the, a non-waterproof one because I haven't checked. I just keep buying the same one over and over again. But I am going to check because, um, I mean, I don't find myself taking a swim middle of the day. <laughs> I live in California, it doesn't rain that often, so I don't get caught in the rain, or you know, I don't really see a need for my waterproof mascara, so. Um, but it, it's really good, so if you haven't tried it, it's like, you know, just regular like CVS, <laughs> Walgreens mascara, nothing fancy. But I love it, it works really well. Um, so I am all about convenience, and so I found this um, Milk Makeup, And what I love about it is that it's a blush, but it's also for your lip. <laughs> so whenever your girl can get two in one, I'm like right here and right here, and I'm good to go. Makes my life super easy. I love this stuff. Plus it keeps my skin looking dewy and pretty. And so I love it. So I, I am gonna go see actually if they have more of these cause I'm a big fan, big fan. All right, so now, once I do have all that makeup on my face, I know it's not a lot, but whenever I get home and I take my makeup off, I have used every kind of makeup removal wipe that there is. Some of them are good, some of them mm, not so good. 
Um, and a lot of times I feel like they either don't remove the makeup well enough or two, they leave sort of a film on my face and then I have to wash my face and it just doesn't feel very good to use them. So um, in one of the IT packages that I've gotten, I think maybe, I don't know, a month or so ago, they sent me a sample size of Bye Bye Makeup. Now, this is not the sample size. I used the sample size and went out and bought my own because this shit is amazing. So it's a melting cleansing balm, and so it moisturizes my face as I'm using it, and it removes all of my makeup, even this damn hard-ass uh, lash-proof, waterproof mascara, okay? And it feels amazing on my face. And it looks just sort of like a cream, like a lotion or whatever. And then when I put it on my face, it melts into um, this really luscious kind of oil. And it, it just, just blends into my face. And I rub it in for a good 30 to 60 seconds. And then I use a, a warm towel to remove it. And it takes off all my makeup, super easy, super fast. And it moisturizes my face at the same time. So if you haven't tried it, you should, you should give it a go. It really is amazing. Okay, now, um, now we get into the skincare stuff. So I have something that I use for day, something that I use for night, and then something that I alternate with. So I don't use like a whole skincare line of things. Um, they just actually, both, two of them happen to be from IT. <laughs> I told you I'm a big fan. Um, and these were both sample sizes that I had received, and then I, when I ran out, I went out and bought them. Um, I use a moisturizer, I use one for the day, and I use one moisturizer for the night, and that's it. I mean, it's not complicated, okay? Drink a lot of water, eat good food, and moisturize your face, and you'll be all right, okay? It doesn't take a whole lot. So um, the first one that I do is I use during the day, this is Confidence in a Cream. And I really love this, it's so rich and thick, and it just seeps into my skin so beautifully and it leaves it all dewy and soft and yummy. Um, and I really, really love this. So I tried this last year actually when I got a package and I've been buying it ever since. I won't use anything else on my face during the day. Um, then, and, oh, see, this is another thing is it's anti-aging. You see what I'm saying? It's anti-aging and your girl is aging and I'm trying to anti-do that shit. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So this for the day, and then at night, I use what they call secret sauce, okay? So this is secret sauce. It's also by IT Cosmetics. Now, the only reason that I don't use this one for day and night is because this one leaves me looking like I rubbed a whole piece of fried chicken on my face. It is greasy, okay? It is greasy, y'all. I look really shiny at night, but listen, ain't nobody worried about what I look like at night, and I damn sure ain't worried about what I look like at night. So I slap this on my face, okay? And then I go to sleep, and it's amazing. Like, you know, I, this is anti-aging as well. And it really is amazing. It's not as rich as the Confidence in a Cream, um, but it, I mean, it's amazing. I wake up in the morning and my face feels like a baby's ass. Like it, it really is soft and, <laughs> and just, I love it. So secret sauce at night, Confidence in a Cream during the day. Okay, so the only other thing that I alternate with is this thing called um, Retinol by The Ordinary. So, I don't know much about this. I just know that I was in New York City with my daughter and she's all into the whole beauty thing. Like she watches every video on everything. And we were walking down in Soho and there was this little shop that looked like the size of a closet. And she was like, oh my God, it's The Ordinary. I've been trying to order it and it's been sold out and whatever. Um, so we walked in and I was talking to the lady and I said, you know, what you got for some anti-aging? And so she gave me this retinol um, stuff. It's like an oil. And basically I just drop like maybe two or three drops on my hand and then I pat it onto my face and I leave it there. And I only do this at night because apparently you shouldn't put it on your face and then be out in the sun. So apparently sun and retinol, I don't know, don't mix or something, I don't know. 
but I follow directions, okay? She said, don't walk outside with retina on your face. Your girl ain't walking outside, okay? Because I don't know what's going to happen. So I use it at night. And then she also said it's pretty strong. So it's 1% retinol. So she said use it every other day. So every other night um, after I do my secret sauce, I'm sorry, before I do my secret sauce, I do a couple of drops of the ordinary. I don't know if it's helping with fine lines. I, I can't really tell yet because I've only been using it for about a month or two. Um, but when I look in the mirror, I, I think I look amazing. So, you know, if I think it's working, then it's working. All right. And then, so this last thing is, so, <laughs> I don't even know if this shit works. So I'm just going to share it with you because I love it. And I, I think I like it because it's slimy and I'm just a big ass kid. And it just feels good on my face when I put it on. But I have a friend, his name is Danye. And he was in Korea recently. And when he came back, he brought me a present. So it's called Incha Gold. And they're um, hydrogel eye patches. So these are really fun. They're really gooey. And basically it comes in this little jar with a little spoon, okay? And there are so many in here, I don't, hundreds of little eye patches because they're so thin. So let me see if I can show you. See, that one already broke because it's so thin. Okay, so it looks like this, right? And it has whatever this hydrogel stuff is on it, but it has little gold specks on it, which, you know, make me think that, I don't know, I'm fancy. So then you just put it on your eyeball like this, right? And then you lay back and you just let it sit there for 20 minutes and it's supposed to, I don't know, rejuvenate your under eye skin or something. I don't know what it does. It feels good on my skin and I do feel like it moisturizes my underarm air, my underarm air, what? So my under eye, not underarms, my under eye. It moisturizes my, see, I told y'all I ain't good at this. Okay, it moisturizes my under eye <laughs> and it makes it feel good and it's a cooling sensation and I like it. All right, I'm gonna take this shit off my face. Anyway, um, now that I look crazy, that's all that I have to share with you guys. I will link to whatever I can in the description box below. Leave any questions or comments or anything you maybe want me to try. I'm down for that. Until next time, peace.